Tonight, America is closer to making space history. NASA completing a dress rehearsal for the launch of the SpaceX Falcon on Wednesday. But because of the coronavirus pandemic, there were a few extra steps added to the astronauts' countdown checklist. Tonight, the first steps in Launch America. Astronauts Bob Behnken and Doug Hurley in those new spacesuits, symbolic of the new era in space travel. The partnership between NASA and Elon Musk's SpaceX on full display as the astronauts were transported in Teslas for this final dress rehearsal before Wednesday's launch. The launch will be the first time in nearly a decade America will lift off from our soil and put two Americans into space, heading for the International Space Station. The Crew Dragon will fire into the heavens on a Falcon 9 rocket. Just yesterday, a fire test launch, checking those powerful rocket boosters. We did a thorough view of all the systems and all the risks, and uh, I was unanimous on the board that we are go for launch. Benkin and Hurley are two of NASA's most experienced astronauts. The two are being kept under strict quarantine for the launch in the middle of the pandemic. We have been in quarantine probably longer than any other space, uh, space crew has ever been in the history of the space program. The men have been tested for COVID-19 twice. They'll be tested once more and are confident they are safe. I think for both Doug and I, the thing that we most want to bring home is that uh, we are still able to do this and, and perform it safely. Taking the astronauts from Earth will be this special spacecraft designed and built in the U.S. It's a test for Elon Musk's SpaceX to revolutionize human travel to space. Unlike previous spacecraft, their vehicle will be all touchscreen. It will take the two-man crew 19 hours to reach the International Space Station, where they will dock for at least one month. And we're going to do it in the face of, uh, you know, the pandemic. You know, where there's a will, there's a way. And there's been will to make this happen. And we're just proud to be a part of it. And we are going to be there every step of the way. ABC News and ABC News Live are partnering with National Geographic and will provide live coverage. Join me and Lindsay Davis along with several astronauts as we cover it all. That's Wednesday starting at 3 p.m. Eastern. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.